A group by a system allows for quite a bit of flexibility in user passwords and client access. This short video will cover the very basics and will allow you to determine what password options are set in your particular system. The first thing to point out is that a default password for new user accounts can be set. If you don't have one configured already, you may want to. Open the GroupWise Admin Console, click System, then System Preferences. In the default password box, enter the password you want to use. Once logged in, the user can then change their own password. If you need to change a password for a user, open that user object in the Admin Console and click on the Change Password button, then simply enter the new password. Of course, this will only work if your system is using GroupWise passwords. Since GroupWise on its own doesn't allow for complex password policies, many administrators opt for authenticating against an LDAP server that will allow for enforcing those complex password policies. To check which your system is using, open the Post Office object, then click the Security tab. Here you can see what type of authentication is currently selected, and also where to change it if desired. If LDAP is enabled, you can see which LDAP servers are being used. If you suspect trouble with an LDAP server, the details of those servers can be found under the System menu, then LDAP Servers. Bringing up the Properties page will show you the IP address along with the other information and even a button to test the connection to that LDAP provider. We hope this basic information is helpful. More details are available in the documentation and in other videos in this channel. Thank you.